television episodes. Are you ready to do this? Okay, so let's start with a massive round of applause. Here we go, keep it going the whole time. Here it comes from the world famous Velasco Theater in downtown Los Angeles. It's the Lock Star is right. And now, celebrating the first annual Do the Sweet Stuff benefit extravaganza, your host has been described as a half ass guitarist, a selfish and premature lover, and Rolling Stone recently wrote he sings like he's choking on a mouthful of cotton balls dipped in dog shit. Josh Wilhelmy! Thank you so much, everybody. perfectly and they try really hard, well, it won't be like that. Yeah. The people I have backstage aren't capable of playing the music good. And that's my... That's my personal guarantee after seeing them backstage. But, well, I want to start off the night with something official, something nice, something to let you know all the hard work that you've done. Because the truth is, is that this show sold out in less than five minutes. And the diligence and the good work was all done by you already. You don't applaud yourself very much, but that's fine. What it means, what does that mean? It means that the rest of tonight is just a way to say thank you so much for doing the hard work. Josh, it's fucking Wednesday, and I get it. Because it is fucking Wednesday. But this night is gonna be fantastic. It's gonna be a night of surprises, mostly for the people downstairs. But before we get started, I'd like to tell you a little bit about the charity that you donated a whopping amount of money to. It's gonna be over $250,000 tonight. Stuff. What does it do? The Sweet Stuff sends one Joshua Hami to Hawaii three times a year. <laughs> Don't fucking laugh. It's amazing to go there. Anyways. About the time that uh, Queens lost a band member named Natasha Schneider, bless her heart. <laughs> to help her. The government always gets in the way, as they always do, you know? You want to do something right, but it's hard to figure out, how do I do something? How do I do something to help? So we try to make it easy, like tonight. All you did is show up and do something cool. Yeah. We'll do the same, Woo! you know? And then around the time the Bataclan happened, we had to help our own fans, and we've expanded, because I don't want to focus on stuff that's heavy. I want to have fun tonight. So I'm going to, so are you. But, we've expanded. Let me give you a little example. We're working with a young girl named Mars who got lymphoma when she was three. But recently she just rang the cancer-free bell at the children's hospital. And said, Some I've dropped off, that's not important. But I don't want to get caught up in all that because, you know, some things are dark, you know, that's how I like dark shit, that's the thing. But, but uh, shush, yeah, baby. I got you, baby. 
the thing is, is that I'm not so good at talking and explaining stuff about charities. So I had a friend, and I haven't seen this, so I hope to God it's weird. <laughs> I had a friend of mine who is supposed to be talented and supposed to be knowledgeable. But I haven't seen it, so I just don't know if that's true. But I'd like to show you a little video that will help to get the night started. Sorry, almost blew that thing. I right, to get the night started and let you know a little bit about how charities work. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's watch this informational video. Hi, Liam Witch here, and I'm gonna Woo. teach you how charities work. So charity is like, uh, sort of like a tube, okay? And if, if the money, that's actually not a very good analogy. There's different types of boxes that, what is a box? Well, that's a good question. So we're all, like I said, all kernels of this one ear of corn. You know, um, you know baskets? Well, these sled dogs, these dogs are, so, every star has an apple, right? No, it doesn't. It's better to give than to receive, except, except for when you get something. The cause Tarzan. These, every one of these vines would... Because oh, I hear, I hear what you're saying. There's only one Tarzan. I know. So, the man will offer the woman like a complimentary breakfast. I don't know how charities work. Do stuff that's sweet. No, no, no. Honestly, that's not helpful at all, honestly. That's not what charities are like. They're not a fucking two. This or, no, it's not. Don't, uh, don't, don't, don't support him saying charity's a two. It's not a two. I know you're holding a two, but it's not a two. All right, fine. Look, tonight's gonna be so good, or it won't. But you've already paid. It's too late. Try to enjoy yourself. Contestant, shit, I'm doing the same thing he did up there. I'm sorry. <laughs> Our first contestant, he's got a Netflix show. It's called Magic for Humans, and he's got a new one coming out on Netflix. It's called Magic Prank Show. It's a very original title. I did not, I have nothing to do with that title. Magic Prank Show, he's an absolute badass and a wonderful human being. Ladies and gentlemen, Justin Wilmot. <laughs> 